With the devastating flooding in Baton Rouge, Louisiana, thousands have lost everything and some have even lost their lives. It's been a time of sadness and despair, but also a coming together of friends, neighbors, and strangers as the human spirit shows the goodness in us all. My family wanted to do its part to help, so we went down to the Convoy of Hope to donate supplies for the people of Baton Rouge. The Convoy of Hope is sponsored by the National Organization of Black Law Enforcement, which is collecting truckloads of items in the parking lot of the Atlanta Civic Center in downtown Atlanta. We spoke with Clarence Cox about how this came about. This is a collaborative effort with law enforcement as we try to give back to the community. Noble, the National Organization of Black Law Enforcement Executives, has partnered with the Georgia Sheriff's Association and the Georgia Chiefs Association in an effort to provide some humanitarian relief for our friends and family down in the Louisiana Gulf Coast area that's been impacted by the natural disaster that's similar to that much of Katrina. Katrina. And so uh, last week as I sat and watched the news accounts of the tragic incidents going on and talked to some of our noble members down in that area, I decided it was something we had to do. We had to react. We couldn't wait on the government and the bureaucracy associated with that. So I had a call to action called Georgia Chiefs and the Georgia Sheriffs, and they both agreed it was time to do something. And here you see what we're trying to do. You know, we talked about some of the bad things that law enforcement do, but now it's time to talk about our hearts and the good things that we do. And most of us work side by side every day, so it's not a hard lift for us to get this done. And we, we actually planned this in three days. And so we're very, very proud of our efforts, proud of the citizens of Georgia, showing that we are one Georgia, and we're going to make this work for the folks in Louisiana. This is just another example of what the police do. Behind the Two scenes. Things. Yes, sir. We do stuff all the time, and people don't know about those things. So certainly we're trying to do some things to let everybody know. We're real, and we got an investment in the communities because we live in those same communities with the pet. That's right. That's something we want to do. We want to get the word out there. Yes, you know, it's a lot of good things. All you hear is the negative things. It's too much good stuff going on. Exactly right. To join in the efforts to help the people of Baton Rouge, go to www.nascanetwork.com to learn more. Eddie G for NASCA Network News.